month of May is one of the Marian month. Let's use the letters in the name Mary to reflect on Our Lady. M stands for mom. Mary represents an ideal mom who is kind, devout, hardworking, beautiful, caring. May Mary remind us of all the great character traits of our earthly moms who gave us life and birth, brought us up as best as they knew. May Mary help us to forgive and heal all those words and deeds and omissions that hurt and scarred us. A as assurance. As we have an assurance that Jesus is with us until the end of the world, we may say the same about Mary. Many Marian songs express this conviction beautifully. One old lady said it this way, I am not afraid of dying. I am sure that as I will be dying, Mary will take me by one hand and my guardian angel by the other, and together we will approach God's throne. What other reason would I pray in the Hail Mary, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death? R stands for rosary. It is said that the one who takes rosary in her or his hands walks with Mary hand in hand. As the rhythm of Hail Mary's and decades goes on, Mary speaks to us of the events of Jesus' life. She speaks about the joys of his childhood, about the light of his teaching and adulthood, about the redeeming and saving suffering, and about the glorious and joyful resurrection. She teaches us that we learn to listen to Jesus and keep his words in our hearts too. Why? As yes. Mary said her yes to Archangel Gabriel. May it be done to me according to thy word. And this changed her life. This changed human history because Jesus entered both her life and the history. This greatest yes was followed by many lesser and small yeses, but these were no less important. Yes to Joseph, yes to the stable of Bethlehem, yes to Egypt, yes to Nazareth, Yes, to be more hidden when Jesus started his public life. Yes, to the suffering with Jesus. All our small or big yeses are for and in God's plans needed and important.